Well, moving on now, Equus Aerospace has entered into a strategic partnership with Airbus Group by inaugurating a machining facility for them in Belagavi. The facility will see a planned investment of $50 million. Uh, Aravind Meligeri, who is the chairman as well as CEO of Equus, told ET Now's Rahul Dayama that they expect to generate revenues of $75 million once the facility is fully operational. Let's listen in. It is about a uh, hundred thousand square foot facility. It's a brand new, built over the last six months, and uh, it has a capacity to have about 150 machines. Uh, we'll have, and we'll be able to generate able to generate 75 million dollar revenue when fully capacitized and used in over next three years time frame. And uh, we are already ready to uh, finish up, you know, fill up one third of the facility in a, by end of this year. Also, you know, want to understand from your the uh, the uh, aviation sector is growing on an average eight to ten percent. So you know, uh, huge demand potential there. How do you see this panning out, say, in the next three to five years? Well, I mean, I need to distinguish between aviation sector and aerospace sector. So we are talking more of aerospace sector here, and uh, definitely aviation sector drives aerospace sector yeah. growth. But uh, it's much much more different because global aerospace is global. Aviation is very local. Yeah. So uh, aerospace sector, you know, is growing. You know, depending on supplier, we grow 100% year on year. So, we aerospace sector is growing a lot more, a lot faster. And as I as I told in my earlier uh, uh, speech, it's going to go to about one billion dollar per year uh, sourcing from India from current 250 million dollar per year. So, I think there's a great opportunity to be player in the aerospace industry today. Uh, one last question there. We want to understand from you. We're hearing that you know, Equus is looking at another round of fundraising. So, how much would this tentatively be? And well. ACUS, uh, you know, ACUS is, has been funded by the promoters till date, and we continue to fund by the promoters, and we have no intention to go to market in any time in the near future. Okay, and moving on to some sports action then.